Welcome everyone to a day in the life of data with HPE Esmeral Data Fabric. The session is being recorded and will be available for replay at a later time when you wanna come back and view it again. Feel free to add any questions that you have into the chat and Chad and I, Joanne Stark, will, will be more than willing to answer your questions. And now let me turn it over to Jimmy Bates. Thanks. Uh, let me go ahead and share my screen here and we'll get started. Hey everyone, uh, once again, my name is Jimmy Bates. I'm a director of solutions um, architecture here for HP Esmeral in the Americas. Uh, today, I'd like to walk you through a journey on how our everyday life is evolving, how everything about our world continues to grow more connected, about, and about how uh, here at HPE, how we support the data that represents that digital evolution for our customers with the HPE Esmeral data fabric. To start with, um, let's define that term data. The concept of data can be simplified to a record of life's events. No matter if it's personal, professional, or mechanical in nature, data is just records that represent and describe what has happened, what is happening, or what we think will happen. And it turns out uh, the more complete record we have of these events, the easier it is to figure out what comes next. Um, I like to refer to that as the omnipotence protocol. Um, Let's look at this from a personal perspective of two very different people. Um, let me introduce you to James. He's a native citizen of the digital world. He's, he's, been, a, he's been a citizen of this uh, uh, and a career professional of the IT world for years. He's always on, always connected. He loves to get all the information he needs on his smartphone. He works constantly with analytics. He predicts what his customers need, what they want, where they are uh, and how best to reach them. Um, he's fully embraced the use of data in his life. This is Suska. She's, she's a bit of, a, um, of an opposite to James. She's not yet immigrated to our digital world. Uh, she's been dealing with the changes that, that are, are prevalent in our times. And, and she started a new business that allows her customers the option of, um, of expressing their personalities in the mask that they wear. She wants to make sure her customers can upload images, logos, and designs in order to deliver that customized mask uh, to brighten their interactions with others while being safe as they go about their day. Uh, but she needs a crash course in digital and the digital journey. She, she's recently, as, as most of us have, has transitioned from an office culture to a work from home culture. And she wants to continue to grow that revenue and new venture on the side. At the core of these personalities is a journey that is, that is representative of common challenges that we're all facing today. Our world has been steadily shrinking as our ability to reach out to one another has steadily increased. We're all on that journey together to know more about what is happening, to be connected uh, to what our business is doing, to be instantly responsive to our customer needs and to deliver that personalized service to every individual. And at Esmeral, we see this across every industry the challenge of providing tailored experiences to potential customers in a connected world, to provide co uh, constant information on deliveries that we've requested or provide an easier commute to our destination, to, to change the inventories um, to the just-in-time arrival for our fabrications, to identify quality issues in real time, to alter the production of each product so it's tailored to the requests of the end user, to deliver energy in, in, in smarter, more efficient ways uh, without injury while protecting the environment and, and to identify those, those uh, medical emerging threats and to deliver those personalized treatments safely. And at the core of all of these changes, all of these different industries is data. Um, if you look at the major technology trends, um, they've been evolving down this path for some time now. We're, we're well into our cloud journey. The mobile platform world is, is now just part of our core strategies. IoT is feeding constant streams of data, often over those mobile uh, platforms. And the edge is increasingly just part of our core. All of this combined with the massive amounts of data that's becoming, becoming available through it is driving autonomous solutions with machine learning and AI. Uh, this is this is just one aspect of this, this data journey that we're on. But for success, it's got, uh, sorry, for success, it's got to be paired. Um, it's got to be paired with action. Um, uh, well, when you look at the, uh, um, if we take a look at, at James and Suska, right, we can start to see um, with the investments in those actions, um, 
how they're how they're realizing their goals. Services, efforts, you know, uh, focus to deliver new data driven applications are done in new ways that are smaller in nature and kind of rapidly iterate um, to, to respond to the digital needs of, of our new world. Um, containerization to deploy and manage those apps anywhere in our connected world they need to be. Secure real time streaming architecture um, from, from, the, from the beginning to allow for continual interactions with our changing customer demands. And all of this, especially in our current environment while running cost reduction initiatives. This is just the current world that, that our solutions must live in. Um, with that framework in mind, um, I'd like to take the remainder of our time and kind of walk through uh, some of the use cases where, where we at HPE helped organizations through this journey with, with, with the Esmeralda Data Fabric software. Let's start with what's happening in the mobile world. In fact, the HPE Esmeral Data Fabric is being used by a number of companies to provide infinitely personalized experiences. In this case, it could be James, it could be Suska, it could be anyone that opens up their smartphone in the morning, uh, quickly checking what's transpiring in the world with, with a selection of curated relative uh, relevant articles, images, and videos provided by data-driven algorithm workloads. All that data, the logs, the recommendations, and the delivery of those recommendations are done through a variety of companies using HP Esmeral software. Um, that provides a very personalized experience for our users. In addition, other companies monitor the, the service quality of those mobile devices to ensure optimized connectivity as they move throughout their day. The same is true for, for digital communication, for, for that video communication, like we're doing right now, especially in these days where it's our primary method of connecting as we deal with limited physical engagements. Um, there's been a clear spike in the usage of these types of services. HPE Esmeral is helping a number of these companies deliver on real-time telemetry analysis, predicting demand, latency, monitoring user experience, and analyzing in real-time, responding with autonomous adjustments to maintain pleasant experiences for all participants involved. Um, uh, another area um, where, a, where HP Esmeral Data Fabric is playing a crucial role is in the daily experience inside our automobiles. We invest a lot of ourselves in our cars. We expect tailored experiences that help us stay safe and connected as we move from one destination to another. In the areas of autonomous driving, a connected car, a number of major car companies in the world are using the, our data fabric to take autonomous driving to the next level where it should be. Uh, effectively collecting all data from sensors and cameras and then feeding that back into a global data fabric so that engineers that develop cars can train next generation future driving algorithms that make our driving experience safer and more autonomous going forward. Now let's take a look at a different mode of travel. Uh, the airline industry is being impaired very is being impacted very differently today from from the car companies. With our software, uh, we help airlines, travel agencies, and and even us us consumers deal with pricing calculations and challenges. Uh, we, with um, air traffic services, we we deal with um, um, uh, delivering uh, services around you know, route predictions, on time arrivals weather patterns and tagging and tracking luggage. We help people with flight connections and, and finding out what the, figuring out what the best seating options are for your, for your travel. Uh, we collect mountains of data, secure it in a global data fabric so it can provide, be provided back in an analyzed form. With it, this stressed industry can, can gain some very interesting insights, provide competitive offerings and, and better services to us as travelers. This is also true for powering biometrics at scale. We work with the biggest biometrics databases in the world, providing the back end for their enormous biometric authentication pursuit. Just to kind of give you a rough idea, a biometric authentication is done with a number of different data points, from fingerprints, iris scans, numerous facial features. All of these data points are captured for every individual and uploaded into the database such that when the user is requesting services, their biometric metrics can be pulled and validated in seconds. From a scale perspective, they're onboarding 1 million people a day, more than 200 million a year with 100% business continuity and the options to do multi-master in a global data fabric as needed. 
ensuring that users will have no issues in securely accessing their pension payouts, medical services, or what other types of services they may be guaranteed. Pivoting to a very different industry, even agriculture is being impacted in digital ways. Using HPE Esmeral Data Fabric, we help farmers become more digital. We help them predict weather patterns, optimize seed production. We even help seed producers create custom seeds for very specific weather and ground conditions. We combine all of these things to help optimize production and ensure we can feed future generations. In some cases, all of these data sources collected at the edge can be provided back to insurance companies to help farmers issue claims when micro patterns affect farmers in negative ways. We all benefit from optimized farming and, and the HPL's Mo Data Fabric is there to assist in that journey. We provide the framework and the workload guidance to collect relevant data, analyze it and optimize food production. Uh, our customers demonstrate the agricultural industry is most definitely my immigrating um, to our digital world. Now that we've got the food, we need to ship it along with everything else all over the world. Esmeral software can be found in action in many of the largest logistics companies in the world. Uh, I mean, just tracking things uh, with greater efficiency can lead to astounding insights. Uh, what flights and ships did the package take? Where, what hands held it along its journey? What weather conditions did it encounter? What, what customs office did it go through? And, and how much of it's requested and being delivered? This along with hundreds of other telemetry points can be used to provide very accurate trade and economic predictions around what's going on with trade in the world. These data sets are being used very intensively to understand economy conditions and plan for future event consequences. We also help answer uh, questions for shipping containers that are, that are more basic, uh, like where is my uh, container located at? Is my container still on the correct ship? Uh, surprisingly, uh, this helps cut down on those pesky little events like lost containers. Um, it's astounding the amount of data that's in DNA. And it's not just the pairs, it's, it's the never ending patterns found with other patterns that none of it can be fully understood unless the micro is maintained in context to the macro. You can't really understand these small patterns unless you maintain that overall understanding of the entire DNA structure. The, help, the HP Esmeral data fabric can be found across every aspect of the medical field. Most recently, HP Esmeral was there providing the software framework to collect genomic sequencing, landing it in the data fabric, and powering connected availability for analysis to predict and find patterns of significance, to shorten the effort it takes to identify those potential triggers and make things like vaccines become, uh, becoming uh, available in record time. Data is about people. At HPE Esmer, we keep people connected all around the world. We do this in a variety of ways. We, we've already looked at several of the ways that that happens. We, we help you find data you need. We help you get from point A to point B. We help make sure those birthday gifts show up on time. Some other interesting ways we connect people is, is via recipes. Through social platforms and online services, we help people connect to that new recipe that is unexpected, but may just be the kind of thing you need for dinner tonight. At HPE Esmeral, we provide our customers with the power to deliver services that are tailored to the individual. From edge to core, from containers to cloud, many of the services you encounter every day are delivered to you um, through an HP Esmeral Global Data Fabric. You may not see it, but we're there in the morning, uh, in the morning when you get up and we're there in the evening um, when you wind down. Um, at HPE Esmeral, we make data globally available across everywhere that your business needs to go. Um, I'd like to thank everyone uh, for the time that you, you've given us today, and, and I'd like to turn it back over and open up the floor for questions at this time. So, Jimmy, here's a question. What are the ways consumers can get started with HPE's data fabric? Well, um, uh, there are several ways to get started, right? We, we, uh, first off, we have software available that you can download. There's extensive documentation and use cases posted on our website. Um, uh, we have services that we offer, like um, assessment services that can come in and help you assess the, the data challenges that you're having, uh, whether you're, you're just uh, dealing with a scale issue, a security issue, or, or trying to uh, migrate to a more containerized approach. We have uh, services to help you come and assess that aspect. Um, we have uh, getting started bundles um, and, and we have, um, so there's all kinds of services that, that help you get started on your journey. So what does a typical first deployment look like? 
Well, that's that's a very, very interesting question. Um, a, a typical first deployment, it, it really kind of varies depending on where you're at in the maturity. Are you James? Or are you um, um, Siska? Right. It really depends on on where you're at in your journey. Um, but uh, a typical deployment um, is, is, is involved. Uh, we, we like to come in, we, we like to do workshops, really understand your specific challenges and problems so that we can determine what solutions are best for you um, to, to take a look at. Um, when we kind of settle on that, we, we, um, the first deployment uh, is, um, it, there's typically um, a, a deployment of uh, a, a service offering. Um, with, with the software to kind of get you started along the way, we kind of bundle that aspect to, um, as you move forward. If you're more mature and you already have existing container solutions, you already have existing large scale data aspects of it, um, it's really about the specific use case that, uh, of your current problem that you're dealing with. Um, every solution um, is tailored towards the individual challenges and problems that, that each one of us are facing. Data Fabric they mentioned is part of the Esmeral family. So how does Data Fabric pair with the other solutions within Esmeral? Well, so I, I like to say there's um, there, there's there's three main areas um, from a software standpoint. Um, four when you count some of our um, offerings with the GreenLake solution. But there are, so there are really four main areas with Esmeral. There's the Data Fabric offering, which is really focused on on on, on delivering that data at scale for. AI ML workloads for big data workloads for containerized workloads. There is the Esmeral container platform, which really solves a lot of um, some of the same problems, but really focus more on a compute delivery uh, and 100% and Kubernetes environment. We also have security offerings, um, which which help you take in this containerized world uh, that help you take the different aspects of um, securing those applications. Um, so that when the application, the containerized applications move from one framework or one infrastructure from one to the other, you, it really helps those, the security go with those applications so that they can operate in a zero trust environment. And of course, uh, all of this uh, options of being available to you where everything as a service, including the hardware through some of our green like offerings. So those are kind of the areas that um, that pair with the HPE um, data fabric uh, when you look at the entire Esmeral pro uh, portfolio. Well, thanks, Jimmy. We really appreciate it. That's all the questions we have right now. So is there anything you'd like to close with? Uh, you know, I, the, um, I, I'm, I find uh, I'm very uh, um, honored to be here at HPE. Um, I, I really uh, find it's amazing uh, as we work with our customers solving some really challenging problems that are core to their business. Um, it's, it's always an interesting, um, interesting um, day in the office because uh, every problem is different because every problem is tailored to the specific challenges that our customers face. Um, while they're all, well, while we, we, well, what we went over today is a lot of the general areas and the general concepts that we're all on together in a journey, but the devil's always in the details. It's about understanding the specific challenges in the organization and, and Esmeral software is designed to, to help ad, uh, adapt um, and, and empower your growth in your in your company so that you're focused on your business in the complexity of delivering services across this connected world that's what Esmeral takes off your plate so that you don't have to worry about that it just works and you can focus on on the things that impact your business more directly okay well we really thank everyone for coming today and hope you learned uh, an idea about how data fabric can begin to help your business with it all of its analytics thank you for coming Thanks.